Hey, Brew for Gaming family. I'm Rayman244, and I'm here today with a Tavor unboxing, but yet, it's not an unboxing, and I'll let you know why. Before we jump into a reveal, I kind of want to share what I'm drinking today. It's a collaboration between Pizza Port and El Segundo, Rip and Bear, an India Pale Ale. We found our package kind of destroyed. Now, with saying that some of our, um, you know, cans and luckily not any of our bottles um, were pretty dented up. Um, the box itself was completely destroyed. So the fun part of this is Buggies ordered a lot of these beers um, off the Tavor app. I had little, no say, so it's a nice little reveal for me too. So let's check it out. Now, we're gonna go ahead and start off with the bottles. This one looks like it's a Fanta Flora Ur Day. It's a mixed culture table beer. Pretty green bottle right there. The next bottle one that we got is called Just Macadamia Barrel Aged Stout. Coovy. Let's see, this one's made, uh, it looks like the brewer is Drecker Brewing. Has like a mean, what is that? Something that could never, ever destroy us. Bourbon barrel aged imperial stout with granola, marshmallows, and milk sugar. Sounds interesting. And you can kind of see that it's a little thick in there. I don't know if you can catch that in there. And the last of the bottles that we got here is Act Two. Blend of two and three year spontaneously fermented cool ship aged in oak barrels on local blackberries. It's brewed by Wander. Interesting. Almost kind of like, like a wine bottle. So for cans, Oh, we've had this one before. It's a Hudson North Cider Company. This one's their standard cider, so that should be good. Now, let's see. This is a quadruple stout from Five Threads Brewing Company. Nice. That should be fun. Let's get rid of this guy right here. Pantera Golden Ale Texas Ale Project. Hmm, born and brewed in Dallas. All right, we got a, a Texas beer finally. I love that it says thoughtfully brewed. Let's move on to our right side. We got Cider of the Month by Ash and Elm uh, Cider Company. Ooh, this one's a cucumber mint. Now this is one of the ones that were dented up. You can see it's a little busted, busted up on the top. Luckily, it did not, uh, you know, rip open and spill its insides, similar to one we had. Um, this one's an American style wheat ale. This one's called Drinking in the Sun. This one's non-alcoholic. This one is called Limbo Series. 3%. I believe this one's also non-alcoholic. Let's see. It's only like 0.3%. Yep, non-alcoholic right there. Limbo series. Hardy Woods Mama Mama's Mean Cobbler. Ooh. Belgian style fruit ale with peaches and spices. Okay. Okay. Who makes this? Hardy Wood Park Craft Brewery. Okay. Very fun. Alright, now. This Henpex uh, was one of the ones that was undrinkable for us, unfortunately. Um, the top portion of the can, I guess due to the way it fell, it um, leaked some of the beer. So this one was, it's a fruit wheat ale, so I know Buggies was looking forward to this one. Oh, this is pretty cool. Check this one out. Who makes this? Anchorage Brewing Company. All right, very cool. Almost looks like a Borderlands style type beer. This one's a, oh, let's see. Where is tomorrow? Question. It's an India Pale Ale. Art by Massive Face. I love the fact that they put the artists in there. 
very cool. He looks cool. 903 Brewers. This one's called PB&J Monster. Ooh, follow up that uh, banana cream pie with some PB&J. Okay. What do we have here? True and Respite. Wheat, Maryland, D. Was that Dose? Dose? D's? Man. It's does. It is does. A collaborative ale designed by 28 Maryland breweries. Okay. Let's see, this one's uh, Block 15 Brewing Company. ESB, extra special bitter ale. Is it extra special? We'll see. Okay, we got an elephant. Everything kind of glows with him. This one is called King of Everything. I'm the King of Everything. Triple India Pale Ale with Citra, Mosaic, Azaka, and Marshmallow. Okay. Who makes this one? Brewed and canned by Tripping Animals Brewing Company. They're based out of Florida. Very cool. Ooh. Is that Nolt? Golden Ale? This one's a very clean can. This one's dairy free, just in case you guys needed to know. Who makes this? This is made by Phase 3 Brewing Company. Okay. What if this is gonna be like a cream ale? It's just golden ale, so we'll see. Interesting. Oh, B-52. Is that after the songs? B-52s? Uh, cerveza. Mexican style lager with lime and salt. Okay. Rig Dog might dig that one. I like the luchador mask on there. Nacho! No, you don't get that reference. This one's really cool. Very like, uh, the negative of photos. Color me a Vienna man. Ooh, it's a Vienna style lager. I like me some Vienna style ones. Oh, it's a collaboration. I like the can. It has like a almost mosaic, like negative, you know, photo type style. Now that's a great collection guys. If you like craft brews just like I do, we're gonna leave a link in the description down below. So that way you get 10 free dollars off your first order of Tavor. Not only that, I get $10, so I will buy myself a beer as well. If you like craft beer and video games, you should check out me and Buggies on Brew for Gaming at twitch.tv slash brew for gaming. We stream every Sunday at 1 p.m. And you know what? We have fun doing it. Come check us out.